Welcome to How to Do Topics channel. If you are new here, consider subscribing. In this video, we are going to take a look at how to program Universal Trisonic Remote Control in four different ways. After you unpack your remote control, you will need to buy two AAA batteries for your Universal Remote because most of them do not come with batteries. You open the back of the remote control and put batteries in, then close it. Method 1, How to Program Universal Trisonic Remote Control with Direct Code Entry First step, locate the four-digit code of your brand's device, and write it somewhere or remember it. You will need it in step 4. My TV is Samsung, I found the code 1311. Second step, turn on manually your component. Third step, shoot the remote control at the component, DVD, SAT, CBL, or TV. Then press and hold the device plus power key until the LED indicator light shines, then release the key. The LED light will remain on. Fourth step, use the keypad of your remote to enter the four-digit code of your device's brand that you found in the first step. The LED light will turn off. The TV will also turn off if the code is correct. Note, use the universal remote control that you just programmed to turn on the component and check the other keys, if they do not work properly. Repeat from step 1 by trying different codes of your brand because most brands have more than one code in the code list. Dot. Method 2, How to Program Universal Trisonic Remote Control with Quick Search Code, 3 Simple Steps. In this first step, manually turn on your component, DVD, SAT, CBL or TV. The second step, point the remote control toward your component, then press and hold the device plus power keys until the LED indicator light shines then release the keys. Third and last step, point the remote control toward the component, then press and hold the CH plus slash key slowly and repeat it until the component turns off. When it turns off, stop there, then press the OK key to save it. Note information, make sure to stop pressing, as soon your component turns off because if you keep pressing CH plus slash it will go to the next code that may not be the right code for your component. Information, check the universal remote control that you just programmed by turning on your component with it. If the other keys do not work, repeat from the first step. Method 3, How to Program Universal Trisonic Remote Control with Brand Search Code In the first step, manually turn on your component, DVD, SAT, CBL, or TV. Second step, point the remote control toward the component, then press and hold the device, DVD, SAT, CBL or TV, key on the remote control, but do not release it. The LED light will flash. In my case, it is a TV issue. Important note 1, if your component is TV chooses TV on the remote control. Third step, if the component turns off, then release the key, therefore you have successfully programmed with the correct code. The LED light will also turn off. Important note 2, make sure to release the key as soon the component TV turns off because if you continue holding the key, it will go to the next code. Therefore you will have to repeat from step 2. The last and step 4, turn on your component and check if the other keys of the remote control work. If they do not work, repeat from step 2, or try other methods. Method 4, how to program universal trisonic remote control with auto search code. First step, turn on manually the component that you wish to program. In my case, it is a TV issue. Second step, point the remote control at the device, then press and hold the device plus power button until the LED indicator light shines then release the button. Third step, point the remote control toward the component, then the power key and release it. The remote control will start searching automatically through the codes. The LED light will flash until the device turns off. Press the OK button as soon the TV turns off, to save the code. Important information, if you wait too long like more than 2 seconds before pressing the OK button, it will go to the next code. Therefore you will have to start over from step 1. In the last step, Turn on your component with the power key of the universal remote control that you just programmed and check the other keys of the remote to see if they work properly. If they do not work properly, you should repeat the process from step 2. This remote control is Trisonic DSRC 411. If your remote control is Philips or RCA, we have some videos on those remotes in our channel. Check through our channel, you will find them. You can program up to 7 different devices with this Trisonic DSRC 411 such as TV1. TV2, VCR, AMP, DVD, SAT, and cable. We hope that this video helps you. We will put the important links in the description down below. Thanks for watching it. Do not forget to like, share, comment, 
and subscribe to the channel. Bye.